So y'all call this Berkeley, right? Yeah. It's a beautiful place. We just came from some cold weather. And we came to some warm hearts tonight. We love you for coming out to see the Wooten Brothers tonight. Check it out. I got my brothers with me tonight. Hey, Kaya, wait. Kaya, is this mic working? I think it's only working down here. It ain't working up there. Because I don't think they heard me, Kaya. Turn me up just a little bit. I said tonight, I have my brothers with me. see me double thumbing, two hand tapping, spinning the bass around. See y'all thought I came up with this stuff. <laughs> I'm the baby brother. <laughs> Tonight you get to meet my teachers. <laughs> I already told you I was inspired by Stanley Jordan. <laughs> Is that guy, is, is that guy unbelievable? I think, I think he's, he's like AI generated or something. Cause that's impossible. Nah, he's the real deal. But even before I knew about Stanley Jordan, I'm the product of five, four older brothers. I'm gonna introduce him to you right now. To your right over here on the keyboard. This is a bad man right here. The hands of soul, the voice of gold. This man, you ain't gonna believe it, but it's true. This man sang background vocals. He wrote the background vocals and sang them on Whitney Houston's very first record. That's true. Maybe not. say that. You ain't sing on that record. Yeah. <laughs> for over 30 years, he's been the vocalist, vocal arranger, and the keyboard player for Rock and Roll Hall of Famer, the Steve Miller Band. That's the keyboard player right there. Y'all recognize that sound. Keep it going for my big brother, Mr. Joseph Wooten. Joseph is three years older than me. Next to the youngest. Three years older than Joseph was our brother Rudy. Rudy Lovell Wu. You saw Rudy a little bit in the video. Unfortunately, we lost brother Rudy. Way too young at the tender age of 51 in the, time, in the, in the year of 2010. Rudy left us on the physical plane. Rudy was a bad man. He played horns two at a time. He played an alto in one hand, just like Charlie Parker. He played a C melody in his other hand. C melody is in between an alto and a tenor, so he was also like John Coltrane. But he played them two at a time like Roxanne Roland Curry. With the soul and funk of Maceo. But in the only way that Rudy Lobel can do it, our brother, Brother Rudy, we know that you're not here with us in the physical, but we feel you, brother, every night. And the people of Berkeley, California, they love you, brother, and they want you to know it. We love you, brother Rudy. And we're going to make sure that they hear your sound, brother. Thank you for joining us. Brother Rudy, I'm going to tell you a story of how you're going to hear brother Rudy very soon. I'm gonna go out of order for a second. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go out of order. I'm gonna go to the first Wooten brother. I'm gonna go to the top of the line, the first Wooten brother to walk the earth. This man we call the teacher. 
You can't call him to teach her. It's much deeper than that. He's the teacher. So think about it. He taught me how to play. Literally, he taught me how to play. He also taught Brother Joseph how to play. True story. So if Joseph and I, if we play something you don't like, <laughs> check it out. When I was two years old, that means Joseph was five. If I was two, that's my earliest memory, was two. If I'm two, Joseph is five, let the sink in right here. Our teacher was only 10. Only 10. Check it out. How many 10 year olds do you know that have the knowledge, the care, the empathy, the foresight, the vision, the care to not beat up his little brothers, but to hold up his little brothers? And he's still doing it today. That's my brother. Joseph's like to say, when Reggie was born, mama was already pregnant with Roy. Not quite a true story, but almost. It's a bad man back here. This man got five Grammy Awards. Not four, five. You can't say that. This man played on two of the songs on Whitney Houston's first record. He played drums on two of them. You can't say that. <laughs> this man is a visionary. He's a composer, a scientist, a theorist, a researcher. This man goes to the future and brings knowledge back. That's why y'all know him as the future man. A lot of y'all didn't know he could play acoustic drums. Y'all gonna hear some drums tonight. That's my big brother right there, Mr. Roy, future man, Wu
Thank uh-huh. you. 